The winner of the fourth round is Mario. Unbelievable. Now, don't be thrown off your game. We're, we're going into your last battle. You will you be our superstar? I mean, we're undefeated, guys. What a mat! What a battle that was. That last one. Shy guys, perplexed express. If you have not seen that, you, you just check it out. Like what a what a battle. But if you've already seen that part, welcome to uh, the next part. I'm not sure. I guess this is part five because we're going to our fifth one. Technically, it should be the sixth one, because the, the setup video kind of counts, but whatever. You'll have <clears throat> fierce competition. Your last arrival won't let you grab the prize easily. Our next star smash up is... Smash. Another girl. Wow, Mario versus Peach. Wow. Wow. New fight, new stage. Two tycoons, one town for the taking. Yes, Big Top. An odd battle indeed. In the last fight, you will be buying real estate, believe it or not. So here it is one last time. I want to hear it. Get ready to star battle. I don't feel like saying star like so long. Because <clears throat> it makes my voice sound weird. Welcome to Koopa's Tycoon Town. It's a pretty cool stage here. We're in the city. Kind of like Mario Odyssey, but better, right? <laughs> it actually looks like a real city, to be honest. Like, in Mario Odyssey, it looks like you're in New York or something. But, yeah. Anyway, crueler than pirates, scarier than ghosts. Riskier than a runaway train. Okay, that's weird. Pirates is Captain Goomba. Ghosts is King Boo. Runaway train is Shy Guy. Wow. What happened to DK, huh? In Koopa's Tycoon Town, you'll play an unbelievably dangerous game. Real estate. Dominant the town. Alright, we'll hear a few secrets. In this duel, whichever of you first earns four stars will win. Here's how you get them. When you pass a hotel, you can pour coins into the place by giving your cash to the Koopa Bellboy. Koopa Bellboy? Whoever has invested the most coins in a hotel becomes its owner, and the owner gets its star. Here's when it gets brutal. Real estate is comp competitive. You could steal a hotel. Yeah, if your opponent puts more coins than you, then that person gets a hotel and you lose the star. To steal a hotel, stuff more coins into the place than anyone else has, and you're the new owner. Here's a second twist. If your cash plus everyone else adds up to a certain amount, Then it's gonna be a two-star hotel. That hotel will grow. Will grow. A one-star hotel will turn into a two-star hotel. But who benefits? Only the owner. So the more coins you put, the bigger the hotel will get. That's how you get stars here. The tr the truly wealthy make three-star hotels and block steals with a hundred coins. Got that? Says. Sees. Says. I mean, says means 16 in French, because I used to take French. Whatever. Raid, develop, demolish. Whatever it takes to get four stars. Alright, let's see who goes first. Well, I think... Okay. Okay, I'm okay. That might be our first dice roll loss, because I think every time we see whoever goes first, I'm the winner. But I guess not this time. Alright then, I'm going second. Peach is first. Alright, the hotel's right there.
So that's why it's four stars, guys. You think that's, oh, that's too much, but no. There's no star spaces, there's just hotels. So that's why it's easy to get or steal a star. This is, it's a, it's a tycoon game. It's all about the money. It's all about the money, money, money. All right, not bad, Peach. She's putting all her coins in. All right, so hopefully, I would like to get a low number because I will get more coins for her, and then when I get to the hotel on the next turn, I will pour all my coins. Now, if you have the same amount, it doesn't count. Okay, good, I got a low number. I kind of want a low number. See, now I can pour all my coins now, and then I can steal that hotel. See, I know what I'm doing. Okay, get a one, get a one. Yes. <laughs> she said yes. Is that all she said? Yes. If she lands on a red space, it'll be like, no. Okay, I don't want a one that time. I wanted a... Actually, that's okay, because I can pour in more coins. See, in Party Tent, uh, behind the coin block, there's, like, more spaces behind. So that's why it's... I like it Party Tent better, because it's bigger. Oh, slow go. Oh, we haven't seen this in a while, actually. We have not seen this since DK. So, I don't think there's really anything I want to land, so let's... Yeah. Another... F I mean, we got three ones, so that's all the ones I can ask for. Holy shit. That's kind of a good thing, because I get more money. And then, like... <laughs> I can, like... The odds of her getting... To get her hotel back are not good. See, look, she's going to put in all her coins in this one. I never got three ones in a row. It's like the only time I want a world number in this stage. Okay, she has two stars. Alright. Do I get the special bonus already? Maybe not quite. Oh, she's coming all the way back. Oh wait, she's not gonna have enough money. Oh that happened. Oh I forgot to I forgot to explain the happening spaces. I forgot. Um because Shy Guy and King Boo messed me up. The happening space Koopa will take you to the nearest hotel. Which basically, he drove her all the way around the town. All you need to do is just reverse and that's it. <laughs> okay then. Uh, nope. There's some versus space, but she doesn't have any coins. Another one? Okay, I got a seven. Oh, wait a minute. I think if I put in all my coins, yeah, I'm gonna put all my coins. It's gonna be a, t a, a it's gonna be a two-star hotel now. So I got two stars because it's two stars. And Peach loses one star, so I'm gonna be winning now. See, it's easy to. Steal and take stars. I only need two stars. Yep. Well, I'm gonna keep up the good work. All right. Not bad. Now, if I get if I can get a ten on that coin block, I can probably I can probably steal her hotel. That one. Oh, she doesn't have any coins. You gotta have coins. Only one coin. All right. Let's try and get a ten. Actually, let's see if there's a happening. Oh wait, I gotta explain the happening spaces. Oh yeah. This happening space, Bandit, uh, you know Bandit from Shy Guy, he will... He will help you... To steal coins from your opponent's own hotel. And then he will give you the change. And... For example, oh yeah, this, this two-star hotel... If Bandit steals coins from my hotel, and then it can actually decrease, it will go back to one star. It depends how much money he take, and then, you know, I will lose a star, and then he will give the coins to Peach. It's whoever, whoever lands on that. 
it's like that's like that's like a good thing and a bad thing. It's a good thing for you if you land on the space, and a bad thing for your opponent. Uh, that's actually part of the DK and Bowser uh, space. I'll explain that. There's a challenge space. This happening space right here. You, I think you play a dark game, and if you there's only I think it's either yeah dark game. Basically, have to land, the dart has to land on your face. There's only one face. It's either you get the face or X, which is really hard. I would I would like to do that. Maybe I can control the dart wheel. I think if you land on your face, if the dart lands on your face, I think you can get like a lot of coins, like 20. Same with this right here. Uh, Koopa. There's a bunch of Koopas in this town. There's a bunch of Koopas. Uh, he will give you coins from this crane. I think it's either 10 or 15. Yeah. Another coin block. Okay, here's a DK space. Hey, it's sort of like Bandit. But, no, opposite of Bandit. Because Bandit takes coin hotel, but DK puts in more coins. Say if this is a... Yeah, if he's gonna put coins in this hotel, this coin will be up to two stars, and lands on that space will be the owner. And you can actually lose stars. And Bowser does the opposite, he's just like Bandit, um, he takes away coins, and it will go back to one star, it depends how much he takes. The only thing, the difference between Bowser and Bandit is, Bandit gives you the coins, but Bowser doesn't. So yeah, that, that's, that's kind of weird. Sorry if that, I don't know if y'all, I, I hope y'all understand, but if you don't, then that's okay, because one day we'll land on those spaces in Party 10, or maybe this today. And that's it, not really much. Let's just go. Let's get a 10. Yes! I can probably steal her coins. Or her star. Uh, I don't want any treats because I need that money. Oh, just in time. Do I have enough coins though? Yes! I have enough coins. Oh yeah. Just enough though. Oh shit! I just won! I won! I already got four stars and Peach has what, zero now? Yeah, she has zero. I won! We did it! Stop this tycoon! Brutally. Brutality? The spending must stop. We have a winner. That's right, folks. This dude belongs to Mario. Congratulations. This was it. This was a lot shorter than the other one. Oh my god. I'm sorry if it's I'm sorry if it's short, but I really care about winning than, you know, losing. Holy crap. We won. We won. That was what, like 12 minutes? That was only 12 minutes. After all of that explaining. Of the green spaces. <laughs> oh man! Wow. Everything. And then I, I thought I thought I won't have enough, but I did. I uh, I put eleven coins or more, and I had thirteen. That's just enough. And it, I forgot. It, it, um, if you add those coins, it will be twenty, which means twenty star or twenty coins equals two stars. Wow. And I did it. I did it. Those three ones in a row, those were so lucky. I mean, like, I got three ones in a row, and I got all blue blue spaces coins. I think, I think I'm ready to, I think I'm ready to challenge Bowser. I mean, like, we already did this in, like, minutes, and we're done. I can't believe it. Peach, I'm sorry. Mario still loves you, I think, but that's the way it is. Oh my god. <laughs> that was like the fastest one I've done, I think. And there wasn't even a special bonus. Huzzah! Yeah, he's speechless too. I, ha I can't even say anything. Mario, get on stage. You've won our battles. You're the ultimate celebrity. Oh yeah, I'm ready. 
As winner of the star battle, you've won the carnival's highest honor, the one and only Superstar. Time for your real prize. Surprise, way better than candy. Sweetest thing ever. Yeah, what happened to the candy? Wait a minute. The candy was in the background, right, in the first part? Who ate them? Oh. You've let the hat out of the bag, my friend, but it's about time. Your real prize is the Star Rod. Wow. If I, if Mario's just staring at it. Oh, oh my goodness. Don't mistake it for your must-have accessory of the year. The Star Rod packs serious power. Frankly, it's a huge relief to find a superstar to hang on to it. So without further ado... Is that, is that how you spell ado? I thought it's A and then the word do. Not a do. Whatever. Hold on! Uh-oh. The music just stopped. <laughs> it's like quiet. I wonder who that voice is. Is that God? And then the music comes back. Why did it just turn black? Did the power went out? Oh, shoot. Wow, Mario. Think you're the superstar? Really? Don't make me laugh. You just laugh. Oh, wait. In a, a evil laugh. Now, if you were fighting in the moron battle, I'd bow down and call you number one. I think that's true, Bowser, because, like, all the... All the computer players were pretty dumb. But this was the star battle? And I see only one superstar. Me? So that rod? Mine. Look at the host. He's like having a Caesar. <laughs> Holy shoot. Better cough it up right now. Oh no, don't run him over. He just took it away from him. Want it back? Come and get it. Or are you a chicken? Bwah ha ha. Bok bok. What the heck? There's not even a chicken character in this game anyway, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think there is. Is there even a Mario enemy or character that's a chicken? No. Bowser's taken the star rod and he's stolen the spotlight. It's the end of the world. Uh-oh. We've been befouled by Bowser. He's walked all over us. Oh, and the stink of the feet. But wait, we have you! Help us make things right. So let's go. We're taking this star battle to the stars. What happened to the star battle? Get ready to star battle! Uh-oh, here we go.